Hello and welcome in to my Christmas 2023 decorating video in Stardew Valley. A very, very exciting one. I've been very excited for this, um, but I didn't really know what I wanted to do until I started making this. So last year I did kind of like a giant Christmas house, like Santa and his elves had come thrown up on the house. Very, very Christmas, very, very loud in your face. And I didn't want to do that again this year, I wanted to do something different, and I couldn't really, like, decide what to do. I had this idea then, okay, I'm going to build a shed, I'm going to make a big shed, I'm going to make Santa's house, Santa's living room, Santa, well, Santa and his elves live. Um, but that somehow ended up not being the case, and after looking through some of the furniture in my head, I was like, I have this idea, and this is the idea. So welcome to Santa's Christmas factory. This is where the elves and Santa all make and prepare and stall and get ready for the Christmas gifts he's going to take around Stardew Valley. Is that a bit of a wild out there idea? Yes. But I thought, you know, it's something different. I do a lot of like just bedroom decorating, this decorating, and I have started to recently just start to do other things, really random ideas. I've made a restaurant, um, and other things like that, and I'm going to be continuing to do more of this kind of thing. So I thought, you know, Santa's Grotto Factory, really good place to start that to celebrate Christmas. But I do loads and loads of these decorating, so if you do like this, go and check out my playlist. There's loads more, like, I say normal, but like, loads of like bedroom ones and house ones and Stardew Valley around ones and making the town just look a bit more lively and just things like that. But there are also a couple of wacky wild kind of different ones too so you're in for a good treat if you're new here i don't normally talk over these i just put some music and i let the build speak for itself because as you can tell i'm a rambler i haven't mastered the art of speaking and commentating what i'm doing yet i am working on it i do commentate over some of them i did my farm one i did it all over that um but i will let the music and the build speak for itself and we can jump back at the end but i just wanted to like pre-warn what you're gonna see because obviously you've read the title Again, it's just something really, really different. And you might be asking, what am I looking at? So this is what you're looking at. I ended up making Santa's factory. And because elves don't exist in the game, I have used Junimos. Um, No Junimos were harmed in the making of this. If you need them, you can take it up with Santa, who also doesn't exist in this game. So he has been replaced with a snowman scarecrow. Um, But once again, I hope you enjoy and I'll see you in a couple of minutes at the end.
This has been Santa's Grotto, here it is, in all its glory. And um, there are some things obviously limited with the shed, if I did this in the main house, I would have been able to add more things in. But you know what, for an idea that I came up with literally on the spot and executed in about 40 minutes, I don't think I've done too bad of a job. I'm so happy I managed to squeeze this in one day as well. Um, and it's a lot easier to do it when you're doing inside stuff because you have to worry about the brightness. Um, but here is Santa's factory, ethically sourced, Happy factory, everyone is loved and well paid in this factory, don't you worry about that. But I hope you enjoyed and as I said earlier, if you like this decorating, I have so many decorating. I post a decorating video or a decorating tips video once a week every Saturday. Um, so check those out in the playlist, it'll be linked maybe now, maybe at the end. And I will see you tomorrow or in the next video for some more Stardew Valley and good cosy game vibes.